Hey guys, good morning. Today, you guys, we are gonna go on a food mission. You guys, I'm really trying to strengthen my relationship with the Portuguese cuisine. Um, the food, it's been, it's been good. Pretty hit or miss, to be honest. Um, I loved anything like with curry, the curry dishes I've had. Uh, the shrimp has been really good. Um, but nothing has just like blown me away yet. And like yesterday, I don't know, the food was very bland. Like I feel like um, I've come across some good dishes, but then like half of the time, some of them are just not as flavorful as I would like. Um, I like things that are pretty heavy and garlic and onion and chilies. And I like, you know, I love curry. I love smoky flavors, just things that are really rich. And I don't know, maybe it's this area, but it seems like they're watering it down. Like they're just like rationing the seasoning. So like I went on TikTok this morning and I found like some recommendations. And so I'm gonna go and like hunt those places down um, because nothing has really blown me away yet. Like I've had some good food, but nothing that just like, nothing that's just like amazing, like out of this world experience. And I can't leave here like that. I cannot leave Lisbon without like a blow me away experience. So we're gonna go ahead, we're gonna hunt these places down and we're just gonna grub today. That's pretty much what this uh, point of the vlog is, just food, 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 food. So yes, let's get ready and go you guys. My outfit for the day, we just got a little bodycon dress. It's warm, um, whoops. And sneakers, because we're gonna do a lot of walking and a lot of powering through all this eating. So yeah, I'll see you guys at the first restaurant and hopefully I'll have a good experience. All right guys, so the first spot on our TikTok restaurant journey is Sol Brazil. And I went with the octopus and garlic potatoes. It was actually really good you guys um pretty flavorful and this was actually my first time having octopus so i'm gonna actually give it a thumbs up it wasn't too bad Next, I journeyed to Mama Shelter. This restaurant is actually in a hotel and they have a very nice rooftop bar. Unfortunately, when I got here, they did let me know they were not serving food at this time. Um, so I just went to the rooftop bar and got myself a couple drinks. Look how gorgeous this spot is though. It's, it's a really nice vibe, I have to say. I really enjoyed the views from here. I ended up going with this orangey cocktail. It was pretty tasty. I ended up getting two of them. So because of that, I'm gonna give this place a thumbs up because it's a great vibe, great views, and the drinks are tasty. Next, we headed to Time Out Market, um, which is just like a huge market with tons of restaurants inside that you can choose from. I went with Miguel's Castro and I got the 
lemon saffron rice with shrimp, caviar, and roasted red peppers. Yum! I have to be honest with you guys, although I did like my food here, I hated this dining experience. It was so clustered, so crowded. It took me about 10 minutes to find a seat because it's like cafeteria style, and it just feels like everyone's on top of each other. Next, I headed to this little pizzeria called Lupita's. I got the pepperoni pizza with anchovies. And look at that, you guys, I love anchovies. And this pizza was so good, it was very fresh. Um, but yeah, it was good, I like this one, I recommend it. Hey guys, uh, so it is, <coughs> it is my last day in Lisbon. And it's a beautiful day, it's very warm. Um, I'm very happy with the food I've gotten like the past four times. Um, the drinks and everything has been pretty good. Um, but right now I'm just walking around. It's still pretty early in the day and I'm just taking the last bit of it. I leave tomorrow morning. Um, so I'm gonna get some dessert. I'm gonna walk around, get some uh, sun, look at some sights and that will be my day. I'm gonna call it an early night because I got a pack and everything. But yeah, it's so beautiful here. And yeah. Hey guys, so I made it back to my hotel safe and sound and as you know these past two days have been really dedicated to finding the TikTok recommended restaurants here in Lisbon and I feel like I tried to do that to the best of my ability. Unfortunately some of the places were permanently closed once I got there which sucks because it just threw me off time wise but I am happy for the restaurants I did go to and was able to film so that was great i think for this entire week my favorite thing is probably the seafood rice i forgot the actual name of it in the restaurant i'll go ahead and post that once i get that together but it was the spiciest so it was definitely my favorite and actually the octopus from seoul brazil wasn't too bad either 
Um, so yeah, I really enjoyed those two moments. I had a lot of good dessert moments here full of gelato. So I am happy to be able to leave Lisbon with that. We've reached the end of my vlog. You guys, thank you so much for watching my little solo travel adventure here in Lisbon. Please like and subscribe the Working Girl channel. If you have like any questions, any comments or anything, please leave me a comment below. Um, again, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys next time. Bye.